What's up everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Chess Doctor is back. I am here with another banger and in today's video we will just be sipping on some coffee and playing some Blitz chess. I have played Blitz last night and I have had okay results. I have been climbing on my ELO subliminally and I'm almost 800, which is like my highest rating in Blitz on chess.com. On Lee Chess, I reached 1000 in Blitz in one sitting, so you do the math, okay? So let us begin by playing some 3 minute Blitz because I stopped playing 5 minute Blitz so much, it's just like way too much, like rapid. When people leave out of anger, they just you just wait way too much, so I don't want to do that. So now we're playing this um vienna game what to do against the vienna game i don't know so <laughs> i just do this and now we're back to the, to the territory that i know of so i go here when it's the three knights game okay sir he he took this up uh i think we can trade this up like this i guess i don't know i don't know i'm just testing it out okay okay he do be doing that okay so uh we're we're just going to go here and try to do this, honestly, because this is hanging. <laughs> this is literally... Oh, it's not hanging. Wait. It will be hanging now. So we have to go and do something like this, which is just looking ridiculous, guys. It's looking ridiculous. But he doesn't take it. He doesn't destroy my position like that. Okay. I think I should take this, honestly. Yeah, let's take that because th and then we don't have to worry about this pawn no more. So I think that's a little bit better. Okay. Okay, we're going to develop here and castle up. I don't know what is happening, sir. <laughs> okay, he do be castling, so we're going to do the same thing. Uh, by the way, guys, I forgot to say this, but they have a Patreon account. I opened it up last night. Actually, I had it when I just started the channel. Uh, but uh, yeah, it's open now. You can use it. So uh, go and check out patreon.com slash zapetzapeti if you're interested in that. Uh, we have to... I mean, the pawn is defended. We can just do this, honestly. We, sh we shouldn't care. We can, like, trade here so that we have vision here. Because that is that is cooking. That do be cooking. We're kind of lower on time, but that's just because, you know, I do be filming a video. I doubt that my opponent is filming a video. Okay, sir? I doubt that. So we're going to go here. Uh, just because we don't care. Just because we, we like to play subliminally. We don't, we don't care. Oh, he get See? As I said, okay, I maybe scare some of y'all by, by yelling so loudly. But see, he just gave the queen. I said we're gonna play subliminally. Come on, sir, resign. It's time to resign. <laughs> okay, I do be. Okay, we're just gonna trade everything up. And that is it. Uh, because at this point, we do not care. And we are just straight up winning, okay? We are just straight, straight, straight up winning. Which is which feels amazing because the dude just gave that queen for no reason. He gave that queen, okay? Okay, he gave that queen. We're going to you know what? We're going to do this just so that we don't have to ever, ever, ever worry about the back rank mate, okay? So let's attack this. Okay, we want the pawn. We want another one. Another sir. Okay, we can't take that. Uh, I don't know, we're gonna go here, okay? We're gonna do whatever it takes. We're gonna take each of his pawns and then we're gonna win. Uh, okay. Oh, wait, we can't go there. Okay, okay, he do be tricky. He do be tricky. Uh, okay. We're just going to double attack and that's it. I think he can double defend maybe. But I don't know how, honestly. What is he cooking? What are you cooking, sir? I don't know what is he cooking. <laughs> I'm just reading out now because I'm plus 11 and I'm supposed to win this. Okay. I think I can win this, though, because I'm plus 11, as I said. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, my goodness. I just shouldn't lose on time. Okay, let's offer here a trade. Because he moved the rook now. I'm lower on time. That's the issue. That's the issue. But he just gave. Uh, he just gave the rook. I mean, completely free. Okay. 
Okay, this this also gave the rook. Oh, he resigned. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Thank you. This opponent was nice. Okay, we're gonna commend the opponent because oh my goodness I was so like weirded out because I'm plus 11 he blundered every single thing and then I'm losing on time and he's flagging me like it I mean, it's fine. That's also part of chess about, you know, you can be in plus 50 position or mate in two, but if you lost on time, you lost on time, you lost the game. Uh, but like this opponent was nice enough to resign because like he was like, okay, sir, I won't flag you. Like you literally won the game. Okay, so thank you opponent. We are 10 points away from 800 ELO. Let's go guys, let's play more games. I'm excited. I do be chilling. We're going to go for e4 because we want to play the alien gambit, but he doesn't let, let us play the alien gambit. Oh my goodness. Okay, he do be playing me the Petro. Okay, he do be copy getting me now because who else plays the Petro in this rating except me? Okay, sir, I don't know. So we're going to cast. Wait. Yeah, we're going to cast. Wait. <laughs> I'm just getting rid out by myself. We're going to castle. Wait, we're going to castle. No, wait. <laughs> okay, we take. Right. Okay, now I'm just like reminding myself of how fried liver works. <laughs> I think we sack here. And then we go here. I I just forgot. I forgot. I literally forgot. Okay, I, I think I did it correctly though. I think I did. I literally forgot how the fried liver attack works. So I, I did this. Okay, he do be trying to exchange the queens with me. I mean, fine. Okay, we're going to do it just because, I don't know, I don't care. Okay, sir, I literally, I couldn't care less. We're going to castle. He still cannot, which is good, so we don't care. Uh, we should go here, here. Uh, because that's the, I think that's the only way. We could also go rookie one uh, to pin the, the, the pawn to the king. Okay, yeah, but let's let's take this because it's more forcing. So he has to make a move, and then we make this move, and then we make this move. I guess, <laughs> guys, I'm just here thinking out loud. Okay, you came here to to listen to me cook. Okay, he just wanna do this, so we're gonna do this. We don't care. We just do be sipping on coffee. By the way, again, another link. Buy me a coffee. That comes with sapatsapeti. We have so many links here. Okay, if we go here, takes, takes, and he just takes, so... But he can't take with the pawn, because the pawn is pinned, as I said. The pawn do be pinned. I, I'm wondering, will my opponent notice it, though? I'm wondering. See? He didn't do anything about it. So we can do this, and then take back with the check, which do be looking kind of menacing, okay? Not gonna lie. But he doesn't want to do that, of course, because he's just, like, too menacing looking. It's looking way too menacing. Okay, we're going to offer a trade here. I don't know why, but I feel like I should trade this up. Because it's just looking weird, sir. It's just looking weird. <laughs> I do be looking like a like a wizard, Harry. I am a wizard. <laughs> sometimes my hair is just like Hermione. Hermione Granger type. Uh, and sometimes it's like Hagrid. <laughs> But they actually have the same type of hairstyle. That's crazy. Uh, okay, I don't know what am I saying, guys, or what is happening on the board, but we're gonna take the pawn because I don't think he has anything. Oh, he wants to trap me? You want to trap me, sir? Yeah, we can do the same to you, though. We can do the same to you, but your bishop is under attack and mine isn't. Mine isn't. Oh. <laughs> We're gonna be saucy. Okay, now it's time to give it for a pawn and to say our last goodbyes with it uh, Because it's just ridiculous to hold on to this bishop that is literally, you know, dead So we have to like be emotionally detached from the pieces that we're playing with because this is just a game That's why people call me chess doctor because I spit fire like this. Okay, so <laughs> uh, He do be cooking. Uh, I think we should just push the pawn because the horse is just like not looking anywhere. And I think that pushing the pawn is maybe best. We could also ask him a question here. I don't know. My horse is just looking weird. So I'm, that's why I'm weird, weirded out. He took the pawn. Okay. Okay. You took the pawn. Uh, we're going to go here. And ask him. Just plainly ask him a question. Hurry up. Hurry up. Okay. He can take this. We don't care. 
We don't care, okay? You take it, sir. He do be thinking a lot. Okay, he can take it again. But we don't care. Take it. He actually didn't want to... He, he wanted to trade it up. Thank you. Honestly, thank you. Because now you can't take the pawn. Uh, okay. Let's just go down. Yeah, we can't take that. But we can go up here. Just by pushing this up. Oh, but he has to move the rook first. Am I winning this or am I just straight up losing this? Okay, I think I should... No, I shouldn't go there. I should just like do something random. I think I should let him do the move. That's how I feel. But it's still very weird. It's, it's so confusing. We have this magnificent pawn here. Which is just looking ridiculous. Absolutely cooking. He didn't give it though. Oh my goodness, stop torturing me, sir! Okay, I think he just won the game because I, because I was greedy. Oh! What am I supposed to do? Help? Oh, this is not a check. Wait, what is happening? Ah! Ah! No! Okay, I'm losing severely on time. Are we gonna, are we gonna flag him? Are we gonna flag him now by just... Okay, sir. I should have gone here. Oh my goodness, I lost in time. I lost, oh my goodness, I was slow in this one. I was slow, but it was funny. It was funny, I played Fred Liver again. I like literally forgot about that existing for the white pieces because he sta uh, started playing more d4 instead of e4 today i was going for it i wanted to see karo khan you know it's weird like chess doctor saying she want to see karo khan how uh, but yeah i wanted to see it because i want to play the alien gambit everyone is playing alien gambit and i want to try it out as well uh but this person decided you know no alien gambit for you sir okay we're gonna play the england because if you can't get the, the alien, we're gonna play the angle. We're gonna push this pawn. We're gonna push the pawn. We're gonna we're gonna pretend like uh, we know what we're doing in this position because that's what England all about, sir. That's what England's all about, sir. Oh, <laughs> oh! I didn't know I had these possibilities of my voice. Okay, we're gonna like push this, put this position to look like very closed for the best shop of my opponent. That is looking very, very weird, okay? So, uh, we're gonna castle. And now we don't care what are you doing, sir? We don't care what the... Okay, we're gonna take it. We're gonna take the pawn. Ah, sir. I don't know. I don't usually, you know, have a voice like that. So, I, I think I can just, like, do multiple voices. Okay, we can attack. Attack the queen! Attack the queen! Attack the most, most valuable, most brilliant piece, okay, sir, okay. Uh, this pawn is, this pawn do be fallen, I think. Yeah, he do be fallen. So we're just going to push the pawn here, because the pawn do be fallen. And it is what it is. So, this opponent, okay, we're going to put my queen on light square. Maybe push uh, C, C5. I don't know what is happening here, uh, but the king is just trying to get in, which is weird. That is very weird looking. That, sir, how is that cooking? How how are you cooking, sir? What 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 dish are you cooking? Uh, come on, opponent! This is like strangling. This is a strangling position. Uh, okay, we're gonna go and jump with the horse and F5. Oh yeah. Hell yeah. Okay, we're gonna trade this horse. We don't mind you trading here. So we're going to ask him a question to be like, trade, trade it, you know? Trade it. Trade it, sir. Oh, I have 137 on the clock. I love seeing that. I'm very happy about seeing that, sir. Uh, wait. We actually can do this. Because the, the bishop is defending the horse. 
We can now attack, which is good. But the king is looking very weird here. I think we should just like sacrifice here, honestly. But then after that, okay, maybe I should have left the horse here and then jump here, but then he can still just take. So we have to like apply a millions of pressures on this sir so that he, you know, eventually like the last one, or was it the last one? No, the one before, yeah, the first one to give the queen, okay? We want him to give the queen. Uh, so per please, sir. Okay, you're gonna trade this bishop now, cause you have to, you have to. <laughs> I should have actually gone there with the bishop and offer a trade and if he trades, then I fork him. Okay, this is now just free. Okay, this is now just like a free game. Are we winning? Are we straight up the banny and the banny? <laughs> Sir, it's called the banny, so... Oh, he resigned! Let's go! Again, 10 points away from uh, from eight, uh, from 800, okay? I almost said 1800. Sir, I don't know where did I get that number because that thing close to my rating. Maybe in puzzles. I only have 1800 in puzzles and that's it. So, uh, I don't know. I think I should play one more game, okay? I feel like... Ah, uh, should I? Okay, I should. Okay, I, I that's sometimes the, the situation that they have in my life. Like, should I play another one? Should, okay, let's try for the alien gambit once again. And he do be playing me Scandinavian defense. Come on, sir, play the alien. <laughs> he doesn't want to play the alien. I wanted to play the alien gambit. He doesn't give it to... Yeah, rooks usually go like that. Uh, okay, we do this. Because this is like a bigger threat. But then we take this. And then he's gonna just trade it up. Which is looking ridiculous. And take the pawn. He didn't take the pawn. Okay. This position is looking weird. I expected zero of these things. Zero. Zero. Uh, where should we even? Hmm. This will be looking weird because I don't want to mess up my structure on both sides. But maybe actually I don't I don't have to castle. This is going to be a non-castling situation ship, okay? This is gonna be a king in the center type of position. I don't know guys, I just I just drink. Look how big this this mug is almost as big as my head. And I drink all of this coffee inside. So no wonder. <laughs> no wonder I do be looking crazy cooking, okay? Looking crazy cook. I don't know what I'm saying, sir. <laughs> Chess is weirding me out. Like, I see these positions. I don't know. I forget about half of the things that I'm saying. King in the center. We're gonna put him up, though. Because he has no... You have no light square, bishop. You have no light square, bishop, sir. Bishop. Bishop. Are we gonna gamble the pawn? No, we should do this. Now nah, we should do... Why am I getting dark? Like, like... I just put my head down and my camera... Oh my god, look! I look like Dobby again! I look like Dobby again! Oh my god, I actually thought that this would happen on camera today and it happened. I look like Dobby again. Which is just crazy. Okay, this is a free pawn. So we're gonna take it. This is perfect with defending this one, which is just crazy. Okay, I think we're going to take this. Because then we win the rook. We just win the rook. How? Because we're playing against almost 800, okay? If I win this game, I'm going to be 798 rated. Uh, so I'm still not going to get my 800, but I'm probably going to reach it today. So he just lost the rook, which is important because we are getting closer to an end game. Uh, plus he's in the check. He has to go... Oh, he just gonna go away. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We love that, we love that. Why do we love this? Because then we don't have to think for the rest of the game. We just won and that's it. That's why I love resignation. I love that pe when people resign because then, okay, thank God, I don't have to think anymore. Because if I know a thing about chess, the one thing that I know about chess for sure is how to lose when you're in a completely winning position. That is something that I have literally uh, doctorated in, okay? So, guys, uh, these are the games. This is my road. 
my road to 800 elo um, in this one sitting. So as I said in the beginning, on Lee Chess, I reached 1000 elo in one sitting, literally. In one sitting, I was just clicking and I was just winning. Uh, here, it's much different, uh, but I still had a lot of fun. The games were uh, uh, kind of tough, but not so much, honestly. Most of them were just giving out pieces for completely free. And the first one, uh, the first opponent was the best one, such a sweetie, he resigned even though he was up on time, didn't want to flag me, which is a very respect, uh, respectful opponent and I respect that, so whoever that is, thank you. And I'm very happy, like I'm climbing my elo, I'm having fun in... <coughs> ah, okay, Dobby, Dobby has to drink some coffee, why? Because Dobby almost choked. <laughs> Because I like speak, and then I, then I'm all of a sudden like. <laughs> but anyways, wait. Dobby, Dobby gonna Dobby gonna leave now. Dobby gonna finish the video now. <laughs> so guys, I play these games. These games were wonderful. I do be amazing. I do be, <laughs> I do be feeling good. I do be making people resign. Actually, they just make themselves resign. I just. I just put the pieces and they just fall for everything. So uh, if you're playing chess today, make sure to relax and to try to enjoy it and have fun. Play the game for the sake of playing the game, just like I did today. Don't play for the sake of rating. Okay, I could have literally gone completely mad, like, ah, I lost the game and I could have been 800. And that is kind of a frustrating feeling. But then you have to look at it like, it doesn't really matter. We are living, we are literally living on a flying rock in the middle of the huge endless universe why does it matter what elo you are in chess okay it doesn't it doesn't matter okay so just play for fun you're gonna win you, you're gonna make people resign just like i did today and that's it so guys i, I hope you enjoyed today's games i hope you enjoyed today's video and today's message uh thank you for stopping by at your chess doctor's office uh, make sure to check out the description once again for Patreon, which is completely new. So if you want to check it out, I'm going to be posting like extra content that is not on YouTube on Patreon. So like uh, if you want to see some extra videos of your chess doctor, then make sure to check out the Patreon. Uh, also check out the description for Discord. Uh, check it out for Soul Crushers Club on chess.com uh, over which we are having all of our arenas and tournaments. And I think that's it. Check out the memberships and buy me a coffee if you're interested in that. And leave some comments. Leave some comments about how you had fun today. <laughs> because I'm just assuming that everybody had fun with me. Come on, sir. I mean, I'm, I'm entertaining myself at this point. Like, <laughs> it's crazy. So, guys, that is it. Uh, have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you for watching me and following me. And uh, that is it from your chess doctor. I will see you all tomorrow in a new video. I hope you had fun and I wish you the most wonderful day. Have fun, enjoy and just be happy because it really is a choice. Thank you and that is it. Bye bye.